Little Red Riding Hood, have you been impressed by my heroism? That's right. You hit the werewolf, what happened after that? After that, the werewolf let me go. And then he ran off into the forest. That werewolf let you go? Yes, he must have been scared of me and asked me to leave. So what were his exact words? I think he said, just go. Why did grandma say just go? Grandma was afraid of Gaston. Grandma told Gaston to get out. Grandma was talking to someone else. Grandma must not have said these words to Gaston. Which means there was someone else with grandma. So where is the other person? Yes, that person should be behind the haystack. And Gaston just didn't see it. So that person must have been mom. That's right, it couldn't have been anyone else. Now I get it, the village chief did see the werewolf take my mom. But it was all grandma and mom played for the village chief. But what is their purpose in doing this? Gaston, there you are. Your dad's freaking out. Grandpa Bart, Uncle Gordon. Get back home quickly. Little Red Riding Hood, why are you here? I clearly saw you get eaten by a werewolf yesterday, really? It seems that it was not her who was eaten by the werewolf. So, Little Red Riding Hood, why are you here? I heard my mother was captured by a werewolf. I'm going to find her, we'll just go find her. It's too dangerous outside. Gordon, why don't you take Little Red Riding Hood with you? Well, that's not a good idea. It's for the best. Little Red Riding Hood, what do you think? Why am I getting nervous unconsciously? Grandpa Bart made me feel weird today. Is it? I remember when I was debating with Uncle Hunter. Everyone crowded around me, but when Uncle Hunter was knocked unconscious, there was a person missing from the crowd. That person is... Uncle Inventor. Or Uncle Beard. Or Grandpa Bart. That's right, it's Grandpa Bart. He was gone by then. I have a wild guess that. By that time Grandpa Bart, had already taken refuge in my house. Carefully recall the previous person's body shape, should not be wrong. So it was Grandpa Bart who broke into my house. 